This is the second rung of the charcoal gasifier. Uh, I added this little uh, extension of pipe to hopefully bring the temperatures down a little bit so I can run it a little bit longer without melting the uh, sump pump hose that I was using for the main hose. Um, I ran it really fast velocity with the fan last time and about 15 minutes in the charcoal had dropped I don't know, about six to eight inches and it uh, got really hot in the output so so trying this it's not really optimal because uh, it's steel pipe so it doesn't dissipate heat as well as aluminum and the pipe is close to the body of the gasifier so it's basically absorbing the heat from the gasifier so it'd be better if it came off a little bit and then you know and then I had extra pipe but this is what I had so so I'm going with right now um, Right now I've got, since I don't have any sort of flap for the, uh, the air intake to shut off the air, I'm using a uh, combination of things to basically cut off the air. I've got a stainless steel cup on top of a, I think it's a brass something or other. <laughs> and then it's on top of a piece of wood, a two by four. So it, 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 it's nice and snug against the bottom of the gasifier so it should you know help put the put the uh, fire out so I just uh, I ran it already um, and uh, even at like maybe 10% uh, power of the startup fan it was still putting out a pretty good amount of gas and a really long flame probably a foot and a half to two feet in length out of the end of my uh, my pipe over here so but I think I'm going to wait until it's a little bit later where I can get a better view of it. Problem is, it's been windy the last few days, so it's kind of hard to stay lit. And I know that I have some leaks in my startup fan, so it's probably not going to be as good of a quality of gas exiting the hose until either I get a better fan or, you know, once I start everything up and then switch over to an engine or whatever. Um, I won't have that air leak in the mix, but, uh, yeah, I, I think with the new nozzle idea that I got or that I have and, um, with the velocity or the amount of air being sucked through, I think this might be a winner as far as uh, longevity for a nozzle. So I'm really looking forward to that, uh, to see how that plays out so far. I've got about 20 minutes about 15 minutes at super high velocity and and about maybe 10 minutes at my what i just tested out a little bit of uh like low velocity stuff and uh we'll, we'll tear it down you know empty it out tomorrow and look at the uh the nozzle but last time i pulled it out after the 15 minutes of 15 to 20 minutes i wasn't keeping exact track but um somewhere around there of uh high velocity the nozzle looked almost untouched so that gave me hope that I might have a good uh, a good thing going here so I'll uh, keep you guys informed and we'll see where this goes take care